Welcome to our demonstration on how to change defibrillation pad vectors during cardiac arrest resuscitation for patients experiencing refractory VTAC or VFib. Perform the vector change if the patient remains in VTAC or VFib after the third consecutive defibrillation. A new set of pads will be placed in the anterior-posterior position. To begin, communicate clearly your intention to perform a vector change. Stop compressions, remove the previously placed resuscitation pads, unhinge one side of the lucus, and log roll the patient onto their side. Place the posterior pad between the spine and the left scapula at the heart level. Return the patient to the supine position. Place the anterior pad over the cardiac apex between the midline of the chest and nipple on a male or under the breast on a female. Once the pads are in place, continue with compressions immediately. There is no need to pause or verify the rhythm until the next scheduled rhythm check. With good communication, the vector change can be performed with minimal disruption to your overall cardiac arrest management. 